have recently started streaming on Twitch. And let me tell you, it is really, really hard to get followers in there, to get people to come in and check out your stream. And there have been so many videos where big YouTubers donate to smaller streamers to support them in certain ways. And I was just thinking, what else can be done to support the streamers? The intention of this video is to go to the small streamers pages to see what they're streaming, to hang out with them, to spend time and to encourage them to keep streaming, to keep getting out there, to let them know that there are people that support them and to let them know that if that's their dream, they can absolutely do it. They just need to keep going at it, just need to keep coming up with new ideas and there are people who want to help them. I got my tea in here, I got my blanket because it's kind of cold outside today. So let's find us some streamers. And by the way, this is the channel that I have created for the purposes of this video. So please don't go and follow it. I just don't want to put my real name as I'm doing it because the purpose of this video is to encourage the people to talk to them and I don't want them to I guess I don't want my name to be showing in who is doing it we have our first person here her name is Ducky Exo and it looks like she's very new to Twitch and she is playing The Sims 4 I love The Sims 4. I used to play it a lot. So let's say hi to her. Let's see what she's up to and see if we can encourage her and make her day better. By the way, let me tell you, it is really hard to actually sit there and talk when you know nobody is listening, but yet you have to continue talking in case somebody walks in and then it's not super quiet. I always get so shy when I'm about to write. I feel like, you know, I'm there in real life and they're about to talk to me even though they don't even know my name, but um, let's go. Hi. Okay, okay, I'll go to the bathroom. Jeez, just pee in the pool like everybody else. Oh, Pink Mermaid, thank you for the follow. Hi, how are you doing? How long have you been streaming? Oh, okay, I'm just gonna kind of, actually, for. Make some money, so let's resume that. My typing is so bad, I'm sorry. I've been streaming since July, I think, so not very long. It's been fun. I try and stick to doing it like three times a week. I want to encourage you to keep streaming. Sims, you got it. Nice! Those are the three that I've been doing as well. Aw, thank you, Pink Mermaid. That's really nice. Thank you. What uh, are your streaming the goals? Let's see what does she want to accomplish? What does she like about streaming? My streaming goals. Um, well, my most recent streaming goal is to get to 50 and I'm so close. I think I'm only two people, two followers away from 50 followers. Um, I follow and then her. I, I think I can apply to be an affiliate. I think that's how it works, right? Oh, I'm so tired, go to sleep. Um, but yeah, just to have some fun and make friends, you know, that kind of stuff. My other goal is to stick to my schedule because I was really good at first and then I kind of started going all over the place. We all want to do that. Crazy. We are all guilty. Definitely. But yeah, when we first moved down here, that was my, this town that we moved to. Uh, I don't have any friends down here, so I'm like, oh, I'm just going to start streaming because... I love playing video games, and if I don't have any friends anyway, yes. I can make friends online. That, so that's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah, it's a great way to make friends. And yeah, just keep because streaming, the because the more you do it, the easier it will get. Thank you, I appreciate it. That's Yay. really nice of you. Yay. Yeah, and when I make more friends, I feel not obligated, but I'm like, no, i got to stick to my schedule, because I told them I would be on here, so i got to Same. Lie. <laughs> Same. I'm glad I'm, I'm not the only one. But you know, it helps helps to have friends on here that keep you accountable. You know. That's true. I also I also really want to get to 50 followers, so I can, I think that's when you can um, get the emotes, right? Make your own little emotes. I would love to do that because I love to draw. So I think that. I'm not sure. Oh, you're not going to the bathroom. Go to the bathroom. I wish I could draw, but I'm terrible at it. I just wing it as much as I can. All right. Well. 
I have to go. We have to check out some more people, but it was awesome hanging out with her. Yeah, her name is Ducky Exo. So if you feel like hanging out with somebody Everyone else, go check her out. Uh, I'm not very good. I just have fun with it. The second streamer that is doing Sims today, and I don't know why I decided to stick with Sims, but uh, I noticed that I met a lot of awesome people through Sims somehow. So we have Bree Zephyr here, and it looks like she's building and decorating her house. So let's say hi to her. Let's encourage her. Again, look at that. She's talking the whole time. She's trying, she's doing good. So let's say hi. Let's bring some awesomeness to her. I'm trying to figure out what to do. Okay. Maybe not, Hi. not going out so far. Pink Mermaid, hello. How's your day, Pink Mermaid? Great. This is why I say the roof is like the worst part for me. It's How is yours? So confusing and just making it look good is just weird. I had an okay day. I went to work and my stomach started hurting. I really felt like throwing up. I actually get sick with my stomach a lot, so I understand what she's talking about. I feel like stomach is like one of the most miserable pains that you can get, especially like when you wake up in the middle of the night with it. And then for me personally, it's been a lot of just, I've been unhealthy and just eating hot Cheetos and just, you know, doing it's the worst like thing you can do. Things are just not the greatest. <laughs> Probably TMI, but I like. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes so good. Oh, you know my pain. You know my pain. I was about to say you know my pain, girl, but I don't know if you're a girl. So I'm like, I don't know. Anyone can like pink a guy, girl. I don't know. I love anyone pink. Can be, anyone can want to be a. Mermaid. My hair is pink. I'm a girl. Hey, what up, girl? <laughs> <laughs> my favorite color is pink too. I have this pink little fan. <laughs> I have this little mirror. Pink. pink approved, uh, definitely. You don't see it, but my big old mouse, mouse pad is pink. What do um, I have around me that's pink? It's like 40, 40 I have like this so purple phone screen. case, but it's not pink. But yeah, almost everything in my life is pink at this point. Mine too! Everything in your life is pink, also. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should have put much. it the other way. Oh, and also, by the way, Pink Mermaid, I'm gonna be recording this to be on YouTube, so shout out to you. <laughs> Here's me trying to be sneaky. Okay, so I want to encourage you to keep streaming. Make your dreams come true. Thanks, Pink Mermaid. You're super sweet. I don't know, I've been in this weird rut lately that it's like, I want to stream, I really want to, but then I'll like put off going like starting it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Like, starting is the hardest. It's happening to me. When it's like, I know it's like fun to stream. Like I like to stream. But when I'm not streaming, it's like, it's like, oh, like, it's like a chore to start almost. But once you start it, it's actually fun. It's the hardest for everything in life. No, like, for real. It's like I overthink it into the point, like, every single thing in life. Like, starting, like, you know, a new school, starting a new job. Oh, my God, starting a new job is the worst. It's like, starting is just the most stressful part about it. I will make my house how it is, and then I'll just start adding things that are not in real life to like just how I would like it to be in real life or just how I think would be fun and fun to play it in The Sims. I actually think it is an awesome way to do it, to play Sims and then to add things in your house, like the things that you would want in real life that you don't really have. The way you get to have them, you get to experience them, you get to imagine what they would be like and that makes you happy. And as long as that makes you happy, then go for it. But yeah, it's like, it's just too easy to look for the most hard things about something, you know, the things that make you talk yourself out of things, mm -hmm. but it, like it really sucks, like it should be um, easier to do it. I always talk myself out of things and I just, it's like, why do I do this to myself, you know? Yeah, so a very interesting thing is that I've heard that our mind can easily imagine what we can lose or the things that can go wrong if we go do something, if we try to, you know, do something new or especially if we try to go for something that we've been dreaming about, for something that we wanted to do so much. But it's important to know that there are so many amazing, awesome things that can happen too that our mind just does not 
think about for some reason. So it's important to tell yourself that there are good things too, that you can do it, and then just kind of start expecting those things out of life. And a lot of times they would actually come. Another thing is that if it was our friend who told us they wanted to stream, they wanted to do all those things, a lot of times we would encourage them. Otherwise, we wouldn't be their friend if we would just keep talking them down, if we would tell them, oh, just don't start it, go procrastinate, go do something else, right? So why then we do those things to ourselves? It's a really weird thing. It's important to treat yourself as you would treat your friend too, as you would treat others too. Encourage yourself, be there for yourself, and just, you know, keep going no matter what. Mm -hmm. My time That's is so straight bad. facts right there. Cause like whenever I'm talking to a friend, I'm legit telling them like, girl, you need, you need more pay. You need this and that. You need to like, you know, tell your boss this and that. Like, I don't know, I'm like always telling people to do like, you know, whatever they want in life. But I never do it. Well, I don't I do that to myself. Sometimes you just gotta be your own best friend, you know what I mean? Let's be our own best friends, Pink Mermaid. Let's do it! I've been trying just to, I it. promise. So I've been posting a lot more videos. Like All right, so this was Breeze Zephyr, or as she said, the people normally call her Breeze. Go support her, go check her out, you know, have fun. All right, so that was it for the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I had so much fun talking to them and encouraging them. I still feel so shy from doing it. Like I said, I feel as if I'm almost there and they can see me and talk to me, even though technically it's completely anonymous and this is a different name. They don't know who it is. I hope you guys are having a good day or a good night. And if you have time, please go to the streamers, check them out. Not just the people that I had in my video, today but just go to twitch like i did do it from low to high check the people out who are streaming say hi to them encourage them make somebody's day better and if you do i would love to see what you did so please let me know on twitter just tag me i don't know somehow get a hold of me let me know what you did it would be really awesome to see but for now thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next video bye